Hey, and welcome back to Lumion Legacy. I am your host. <laughs> and today we're going to take a look at some uh, secrets, some hidden things and Easter eggs, or some of them at least, uh, from Atlantean City. Well, this place was released like a while ago, but I recently started playing again and I love to cover uh, down some secrets, some Easter eggs hidden around the areas that's been released and I guess you have seen some of them in other videos but maybe some of them are new to you but if you have seen anything else just share in the comments and I might include this in another video so the first well a kind of a secret but if for the players who doesn't talk to every NPC that's being uh, added to the updates well some of them say something quite interesting and one of them is this NPC right here. So I'm going to click for this. I heard it recent. The submarines are shaped like giant lumians. Is that it scares away predators. That's why my father told me. Anyway, I don't think I've ever heard of a submarine being attacked by any lumians. So I guess it works. And this thing here is shaped like... What is that lumen called again? Uh, well, I guess you guys can tell me in the chat. Let's see who is correct and I will pin that comment uh, on top of um, of the commentator section. So what lumen is this? But you can see it's shaped like a lumen. So that's kind of like a small secret if you talk to this this one because most of the players just spawn in and run and does the update and then logs off. But if you go around and look a bit, you can actually find cool hidden things like this. All right. Over to the next one. Right, so we are at the uh, entertainment district and inside the Atlantean Arcade, there's actually a reference to Brick Bronze, which is quite nice. So all you have to do is go into the arcade and you need to go into the back room. Well, before I go in there, all these games are based on the old uh, Brick Bronze games that was released in, uh, in Pokemon Brick Bronze. So, well, then you know that, that's kind of cool. Um, the next one is in the back room. Um, which is not that hidden, but if you just run, you will pass it. But over here, here's the old machine from Brick Bronze where you got your Pokemon, uh, like the these ones out here. Um, this one, Pokemon Storage and Lumion Storage. So that's kind of a cool thing they added in, some small uh, features from Brick Bronze. Quite nice, love it. All right, over to the next one. The next one is located in the inter entertainment area as well. Uh, it's to the right of the Atlantean Arcade, which is called the Super. Uh, well, it's a superstore which sells the uh, Lumi Watch uh, designs that we will see later in a future update. And the guy that sells it is actually based on Chris Super. Uh, welcome to Super. I see you already have uh, the latest model Lumi Watch. Once uh, we're all set up, we will offering new watch styles and themes for Lumi Watches. Come back soon. So they will add all of these cool colors, and uh, I don't know how you can buy them either with Robux or whatever, and or unlock them. So we will see. But this guy is based on the developer called Chris Super, which is quite uh, a nice detail. So anyway, let's check out the next one. All right, so now we are in the museum. There's a few secrets in here, and one of them is related to Brick Bronze as well. They actually had a, a lot, a lot of Brick Bronze references in, in, in this update, which is really cool. The first one is over here. That's the submarine. You can see the new one right there, and the old one from Brick Bronze. They actually added this in the game, in the museum. And I understand why it's here, because, you know, that was a legendary game. This is a legendary submarine, so quite nice detail right there. Anyway, let's go to the next one. Well, the next one is not really a secret, it's quite obvious. It's the huge board here that explains that the Lumi Watch, the early Lumi Watch, looked like this, like the original one, and it changed the one we have here. So you can see the old one looks like that with the different colors. Looks like a YouTube play button, to be honest. Uh, maybe that's a reference? No, I'm just kidding. Uh, but that's the old Lumi Watch, and this is the first. Uh, capture disc that was uh, made. Quite cool detail, looks like the Iron Man, well the heart of Iron Man to be honest. Uh, I don't know if that's the ideal here, but still looks like it. Uh, so that's a cool detail, they added it with some lore on the board right here. You can pause the video if you want to read the lore or go here yourself. Anyway, let's go to the next one. On the second floor of the museum, we can see this thing right here, which is the fossil or the shell of Van Tizian or whatever it's called. Let's check the name. It's right down here and let's scroll. It's right there. Uh, Ventasian or whatever it's called. So this is like the, the shell on this thing. So it's quite cool detail right there. 
you can see it's like really, really old. So it means that this Lumion has been here for a long, long time. Anyway, let's check out the next one. All right, the next one is not really a secret, but if you don't look up in this game, well, you should start doing that because you can see Voldeca right there swimming around and protecting the city. That's at least what some NPC says. And there's been a lot of questions if you can actually obtain this Lumion in the future. I really, really hope so, but this thing is so massive. So if you're gonna have that behind you, like I have Dusky right here, it's gonna take this here or this whole area <laughs> but i guess maybe if we can catch in the future maybe you will get like a machine that you can shrink it so it will be kind of like this size and it will still follow you i really hope so developers please do that <laughs> that'll be amazing but remember to look up guys because the animation and the view of this grand lumen is absolutely breathtaking one of the best uh, things they have added so far. I love it. Hopefully we we'll see more of this in the near future. All right, let's go and find the next. All right, so the last one at least I have seen is in Lucky Wheel. And this is a reference to a uh, Lumen Legacy YouTuber. It's this guy over here. I think this is Lucky HD actually. So if you talk to this guy, I keep missing the prize that I really want. I guess I'm not very lucky as you can see. And has the same shirt as well as Lucky HD. So that's a cool, cool add on there. Congrats, Lucky, you're now in the game. All right, so that was all of the Easter eggs and secrets I could find in Atlantean City. Hopefully, you guys enjoyed the video. If you have found something else, please tell me in the comments. Don't forget to subscribe, don't forget to follow me on Twitter. The link is in the description, and I'll see you guys in the next one. Take care now, and good. Bye.